it may be a talented team, but Sinol's lack of confidence is dooming its chances in the Philippine Super League All Filipino Conference. Head coach Edgar Baroga said their lack of end game poise worked to their disadvantage, prompting them to surrender a sorry five set loss to Petron in their previous game at the Calican Sports Complex over the weekend. In that match, Francis Molina and Mika Reyes did the damage for the Blaze Spikers, who cruised to their fifth straight win in this season ending conference. On the other hand, skipper Rachel Ann Daquis, Shirley Salamagos, Mume Vivas and Malene Potts surrendered to pressure in the second and third sets, sending the HD Spikers to their third loss in six games. Baroga said they have to improve their confidence if they want to go far. I want them to be more confident against any team, be it a team to beat like Petron or any other team, said Baroga whose crew will face Smart on Tuesday at the Philoyal Flying V Center in San Juan. Actually, the HD Spikers have nothing to be nervous of. Dakwitz is overflowing with local and international experience after leading Petron to a clean sweep of the All-Filipino Conference in 2015, before seeing action in various international tourneys, including the prestigious FIVB Women's Club World Championship in 2016. Pot is also the rising star who made her presence felt in the Asian Games and Asian Women's Cup early this year, while setter AC Masangke and libero Jack Dianella were part of the national squad in a couple of international tourneys. Of course, open spiker Royce Tubino is also a many-time national team member as well as Javelin Gonzaga, who remains injured but still contributes some valuable nuggets from the bench. Baroga said what he has is a very strong team. All they have to do is to be confident enough and trust themselves, especially when the going gets tough. They have what it takes to win games, he said. But sometimes I can sense that they don't trust themselves enough, and it shows with the way they play inside the court. Dotty said there's nothing to solve it, but a morale-boosting win. That's why we will go all out on Tuesday. We want to post a big win that would give us the confidence moving forward.